Hello, welcome everybody. Uh, my name is Kevin Nilsson and uh, I'm here with the gRPC team. Uh, myself, I run the Java, Go, and Python team and focus mostly in the open source world um, for gRPC. I wanna thank all of you for coming. I know all of you have a very, very busy day. You have a lot on your plates. These are busy times for all of us. And I wanna thank you for taking the time, spending it with us. We've done a lot of work to prepare for hopefully what you find to be a great event. Uh, we do have free Wi-Fi here, uh, Alphabet Guest, and you don't need a password for that. Um, I did wanna ask a few questions before we get started. Um, how many of you, is this your first gRPC conf? Awesome, hopefully this will be the best. Do we have anybody who's been twice? Anybody we saw over in MP6? Awesome, yeah, so MP6 is the building just over this way, and that's actually where a majority of the gRPC team uh, sits. And last year, we were able to do our conference uh, in that building. The, the closest building across the way, MP3, that's where everything began uh, with gRPC. So you are very lucky to be right in the heart of where a lot of the exciting gRPC work um, is done. So do we have anyone who was with us before COVID and has done three or four gRPC comps? Yeah, in the back, several. Doug's on the team, that doesn't count. <laughs> cool. And then uh, what about languages? Um, how many Java developers do we have? Awesome, awesome. Android Kotlin also? Any of that? Yeah, yeah. Um, Go? Cool. Python? Cool. So now I want to ask, how many people at either yourself or your company are using gRPC in two or more languages? Wow, that's exciting. Three or more? Now we're getting toward the polyglot, four or more? Five or more languages? Anyone? Maybe? Benjamin's thinking about it. Yeah, that's really awesome. That's really awesome. So uh, we would love to hear more about uh, what you're doing, and uh, hopefully we have something for everybody uh, here at gRPCConf. So before we get started, I did want to thank our, our two main sponsors, uh, Google Cloud, for helping to provide this great venue, it's really, really nice. We're excited uh, about the space and thank Google for that. And then Buff, who is uh, our gold sponsor uh, for today. Finally, I wanna thank the, the CNCF. Uh, so the CNCF uh, is sort of not only the one of the sponsors of today's event, has been working for about a year to make this happen. Uh, you know, they're also uh, you know, the, the owner of gRPC. And so gRPC is a CNCF project. Uh, we're in the incubating state, and we're hoping to submit a, a proposal for graduation uh, in the next few months. Cool. Um, a few key people I wanna thank uh, on the, the program committee. These are the people who went, analyzed the talks, actually reached out to speakers, trying to get additional speakers, and put together the, the great set of talks that, that we have today at the conference. Uh, I wanna thank Terry over there. Uh, he's been working for about a year on the conference. And I wanna thank Connor, who's done just a tremendous amount of work. And then um, many of you know Antoine, uh, who spoke at the last two gRPC conferences um, from Datadog. Uh, he's also been a, a great committee member. And so um, the four of us, myself as committee chair, and the three of them have really done a great job. Want to thank them and maybe a quick round of applause for putting together. <laughs> so today at gRPC Conf, we've got over 30 members of the gRPC team here with you today. So you can see a lot of their pictures here. Um, almost everyone on this slide is here today. And so if you have questions, if you want to learn more, uh, these are really great people um, to reach out to and you know, learn about, ask your questions, but also to provide feedback. You know, one of the main reasons that we're doing this conference is so that we can hear from you, hear the things that you want, hear the areas that you love, but also hear the things that you don't love and things that we could do better. 
So that is really the main reason we're here. So please feel open to share with all of us, share with your peers, and uh, help us make gRPC better um, for everyone. Uh, there are two people that I would like to give uh, a very special thanks to in our community. Uh, the first is Antoine, who I talked about. Uh, so Antoine uh, has made significant contributions in gRPC Go, and we're very, very thankful for that. And we met Antoine at KubeCon in Paris, uh, near his home, rather than here we are near my home. Uh, so we met Antoine in Paris and, and talked about getting deeper involved with the team. And we all knew Antoine, basically everyone on the gRPC team knew Antoine quite well from the many contributions. And we brought Antoine in as a maintainer uh, for gRPC. So very, very happy with that, and we would love to see more of you uh, do the same thing. So I want to do a quick round of applause for, for Antoine. So many thanks. Uh, secondly, one of the things that we're going to talk more about later today is our development with Rust. Um, so, so Lucio has had a project with Tonic uh, for, for a long time that's been very successful, and the, the, the team here, um, you know, the gRPC team has worked with Lucio, kind of bringing, uh, partnering with him on development that we're starting around developing um, a Rust implementation of gRPC under CNCF. So we really want to thank uh, Lucio for all those efforts, but also all the great collaboration, both that we've had recently and ongoing in the future. So thank you, Lucio. So I wanted to let everybody know about a few resources that we have out there. Um, the first, I'm sure everyone here has seen our GRP uh, CIO uh, main website. That's where all the documentation are. Um, you know, you can stay connected with everything through there. I'm sure most of you are aware of that. We also have a Google group. And in that Google group, it's, a, it's an open discussion where you can post your questions, your learnings, your findings. It's a nice online community um, for all of you. So please check that out. Uh, if you're not a member, sign up. Um, another thing that we have uh, is we run, uh, about once a month, we run a meetup. And you'll remember when you registered for gRPC Conf, you answered a few questions. And one of those was, are you interested in attending on in-person meetups or interested in doing virtual meetups? And so we want to continue to do that based on the results that we heard from you. A pretty high majority of people are mostly interested in in-person events. So we assume over the next year, we'll plan more in-person events, but I think we'll still do some virtual events as well. So encourage all of you to join the meetup if you haven't, and come meet with the team and learn more about gRPC. Um, and then finally, um, we post on Twitter various announcements, and so go to X, and uh, that's our, our group there. And then last but not least um, is YouTube. So we have a, a YouTube channel. Um, check that out. We've got a ton of great videos, and I'll show uh, some of the updates there in, in one of the upcoming slides. So um, we know, you know that developers are very, very important to us. One of our main, main goals is making it easier for you to consume and use the APIs and frameworks that we provided for you. And one of the things that we learned at gRPC Conf um, you know, two years ago when we met um, in, in Detroit at the, the KubeCon, uh, one of the things that, that, that we learned from all of you is that you didn't feel our documentation was good enough. And so we put a lot of effort into it. Uh, many thanks to Terry. Terry's been leading the way on a lot of that. Put a lot of effort to go out there, add a bunch of new user guides. And it was, uh, a, I think, a number in the 20 or 30 that were added uh, in, in 2023 added another six this year, added a bunch of new code examples. We actually added a bunch of uh, tutorials as well. Uh, they're gonna go up in the next few weeks. And then um, the video, uh, we've recently added 23 new videos. And so we're working on, right now we have about 10 more that are kind of in early production as well. So you'll see more from that. So I know many of you probably are not subscribed to that YouTube channel because it is something that we've more recently started investing in, but Highly recommend it. Please check it out. We would appreciate that. 
and uh, you know, enjoy the content. And absolutely, if anyone here would like to contribute a video to that channel, if you want to talk about some of the things that you've done, talk about your experience with gRPC, teach someone how to do something related to gRPC, we'd love to partner with you and get your video uh, up on our YouTube channel. So please, absolutely feel encouraged to do that and let us know um, if you're interested. Cool. So I want to talk about some of the ongoing growth uh, we have seen with gRPC. And this is, uh, every time we do an event like this, we try to speak at all the, the KubeCons as well. And every time we do an event like this, I pull up this chart um, from GitHub Stars to see, you know, how are we trending? And I always get a little nervous, but um, you know, for the last two and a half years that I've been on the team, uh, I continue to see that growth. And that's much thanks to all of you. And um, you know, I wanna thank you again for you know, making gRPC a huge success. And I wanna thank the team for working so hard to try to keep things relevant, you know, new features, bug fixes, and make gRPC great for everyone. Want to share a few of the, the successful metrics that we have with gRPC. Uh, in Maven Central, um, 70.9 million weekly downloads. Um, so that's a really, really big number. Python, 25.8 million. And MPM with 10 million weekly downloads. So it's getting used, getting used a ton. And uh, we're really, really excited to see that and uh, continued growth of gRPC. So uh, thank you, everyone. And with that, I'm going to hand it off to Abhishek. He's my boss, director of engineering here at Google. And Abhishek has a very, very interesting perspective because we are here today sort of celebrating 10 years of gRPC. And Abhishek is uh, one of the founding members. And he's going to share a little bit about his time at gRPC.